So my daughter Jacinta watches a lot of YouTube. My daughter Jacinta watches a lot of YouTube. The other day, she was logged into my YouTube account while she was watching YouTube. And so I grabbed my iPad the next morning and I've got a whole YouTube feed full of skateboard fails and world's fastest electric scooters and all of the things she wants me to buy her for her birthday. And there was a ton of videos in a theme called Nailed It or Failed It. And so in this little activity that you just did, you either nailed it, you've got a plan for, the, for getting 100 leads by this time tomorrow, or you don't. And maybe as a group you did, but you as an individual don't know how to implement that. You either nailed it, I, I can get 100 leads whenever I want, or you don't. So let's find out. Hands up, nailed it. Oh God. Hands up, failed it. Hands up is not gonna raise their hand no matter what I ask. That means probably failed it, doesn't it? Let's be honest. Okay. We were on a Zoom call the other day uh, with our on-ramp group and we had them write out their 5130 posts. And then everyone's like feeling excited about it. It's their very first interaction with us. I'm like, great, how'd you go? Awesome, are you excited about it? Yeah, okay, great. I'm gonna put three minutes on the clock now, send it. And then you hear this, doom, doom. Somebody left the Zoom. And I'm like, did you hear that? You know what that sound was? And I'm like, what? That's the sound of a coward leaving. Turned out they just had Zoom problems and they dialed back in, but the, the joke was worth it. <laughs> Just have since left the program and asked for a refund. No, they haven't. Okay, so nailed it or failed it. Hands up again, nailed it. You can get 100 leads tomorrow. Great, hands up, failed it. Okay, we've got to fix that. When it comes to your lead flow, there should be a, a triangle called the lead flow progression. When it comes to your lead flow, if you think about lead flow like water through a pipe, some of us have a pipeline that is, that is blocked. Yeah, it's all blocked up. There's been no new leads in ages. You have to keep going back to the same old dead tired list that isn't going anywhere. Yeah, no new leads in ages. You have to keep going back to the same old guys. Hey, it's me again. Do you want to buy anything? Nope, crap, didn't think so. Let's try again in a couple of weeks time. Uh, next up, some people have okay lead flow, but the actual, uh, the pipeline is leaky. You know, leads come in and they just don't go anywhere. M you know, maybe you meet people and you start conversations and the conversations just fall off. Then there's a bunch of coaches who have a trickle, a trickle. They've got sort of enough leads to live on, not really to grow, maybe to maintain. Next level up, we've got a flow. What do we have, huh? Yeah, that's enough leads to grow at a kind of steady, stable, slow rate. You know, you can bank on a flow, it's good. And then there's one more level, which is a flood, which is like, I've got too many leads and my business is kind of taking off. Okay, so there's five levels. Really, if we're honest about it, there's two. Above this line, there's enough leads to grow my business. And below this line, there's not enough leads to grow my business the way I want. So right now, it's either red or it's green. Now, I don't really care where it was, but my hope is that everybody in this room, when I say, what's your plan for getting 100 leads, you'll know exactly the plan. And by tomorrow morning, you'll have some leads.